NASA's innovative helicopter technology and the ambitious Mars sample return missions are paving the way for unparalleled achievements. From traversing the dusty terrain of Mars with the Ingenuity helicopter to formulating detailed plans for transporting Martian samples back to Earth, these initiatives extend beyond mere exploration. They aim to render interplanetary science more accessible and transformative. In this video, we will delve into the lessons learned from Ingenuity, the technologies integral to this mission, the next generation of planetary helicopters, the strategic challenges encountered, and the profound impacts these missions will have on the future of space exploration. Ingenuity made its first flight on Mars in April 2021. The helicopter has provided invaluable data on the dynamics of flying in the Martian environment, where the atmosphere is just 1% the density of Earth's. This data is crucial for future aerial missions and has already begun to inform new designs and concepts for Martian rotorcraft. Ingenuity's flights on Mars faced significant navigation challenges. The Martian surface is mostly flat and lacks clear landmarks, which are usually needed for navigation. To move around, the helicopter used its camera and smart software to find its way. This showed how important it is to have better self-guiding technology that can handle the special conditions on Mars and other planets. Moreover, the environmental conditions on Mars tested Ingenuity's limits in unexpected ways. The intense cold, for example, posed a threat to its electronic systems, which had to be insulated against Martian nights when temperatures were much lower than Earth. The solar-powered helicopter also had to maximize its energy efficiency to accommodate the weak sunlight available on Mars, especially during dust storms and in the shadowy regions of Jezero Crater. Ingenuity's Mars missions taught us two main lessons. First, keeping equipment warm and energy efficient is crucial for surviving Mars cold nights. Second, the ability to navigate without many landmarks led to advances in visual tech and AI. These improvements are now being used to design better Mars helicopters that can fly more independently and handle power more efficiently. Building on the unprecedented success of Ingenuity, NASA is already in the advanced stages of planning its next generation of Martian helicopters. These are equipped with enhanced capabilities to navigate more challenging terrains and perform more complex scientific tasks. For instance, these missions are expected to have increased flight durations and greater mobility. It also will incorporate more robust scientific instruments, which will allow the helicopters to collect data on the Martian atmosphere, weather patterns, and surface composition. As Ingenuity was helpful, this new mission also will be invaluable in identifying interesting scientific targets for future missions or even human explorers. The new Mars helicopters are also expected to collect samples from varied Martian terrains, some of which may be inaccessible to rovers. These helicopters will enhance the sample return mission by gathering a broader range of Martian samples for Earth-based analysis. It will enable space logistics with fast sample transport from various Martian sites to a central hub, which will enhance efficiency, reduce mission risks, and simplify operations. However, these helicopters must be engineered to endure Mars' extreme conditions. A pivotal response to NASA's call came from Boeing, proposing a streamlined mission using the Space Launch System, the most powerful rocket in existence. This proposal suggests a single launch strategy to deliver and return samples, which could potentially minimize the complexities and risks associated with multiple transfers in space. However, this comes with high costs associated with the Space Launch System, sparking debates on financial feasibility amidst NASA's budget constraints. The potential integration of advanced helicopters could play a crucial role in addressing these financial and logistical challenges. By utilizing helicopters for sample retrieval, NASA may reduce the need for multiple rovers or additional landers. This approach not only simplifies the mission architecture, 
but could also lead to significant cost savings and enhanced mission flexibility. Despite the promise of innovation, integrating helicopters into the MSR mission is laden with challenges. The technical demands of ensuring these helicopters can operate effectively on Mars are non-trivial. They must withstand extreme environmental conditions, perform precise maneuvers, and handle delicate samples without contamination. Furthermore, the logistical complexities of coordinating these helicopters with other mission elements underscore the need for impeccable planning and execution. Looking ahead, the integration of helicopter technology in MSR missions exemplifies NASA's commitment to innovation in space exploration. These advancements could set new standards for future missions, potentially making Mars and other celestial bodies more accessible. The success of these initiatives could pave the way for more ambitious endeavors, including manned missions to Mars and the establishment of permanent bases. In conclusion, the Mars Sample Return Mission, MSR, is a turning point in space exploration. It combines advanced technology and planning to efficiently retrieve Martian samples for study on Earth. This paves the way for groundbreaking discoveries and inspires future generations of scientists and explorers. Thank you for exploring this exciting frontier with us. As we look to the future, the journey to Mars reflects not just a scientific endeavor, but a testament to human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of knowledge. Stay tuned as we continue to follow NASA's progress in making interplanetary exploration a more tangible reality for all of humanity.